Screw the children! Uvalde Police! Lieutenant Commander Martinez! Oh my word! Uh, angry Meme Review! Welcome to another edition of Angry Meme Review. I'm your host, AC, and this is where I break down your fantastic and often, and they better be more, disturbing memes that you've collected and sent to me from the internet by tagging hashtag Angry Meme Review so that I can see it on the Reddits, Facebooks, Instagrams, Farmers Only, Carfax, Big Lots, or wherever you post your fantastic memes. Now in every Angry Meme Review, I give you some homework to help you meme, get your brain tingling a little bit. And last, Angry Meme Review is no different. This was your Angry Meme Review homework on the last episode. Mmm, look at that. A man being tortured by demons and then me either helping or not helping. It's up to you. Facebook. Facebook came through. Very surprising. Reddit came through with some good stuff too. But before we go and break down your fantastic memes, the randomness, and your homework, a word from our sponsor. But first, let me ask you, have you ever Googled yourself? Well, there's companies out there called data brokers that collect all that juicy little tidbits of information and they sell it to scammers, hackers, governments. That's right, the government is tracking you and seeing where you go to, which site you use, which is why I started using Aura, today's sponsor. Now cleaning up all my information does reduce the amount of spam that I get, but it also protects me from hackers using this type of information in order to get into my social media accounts, bank accounts, or other sensitive information. With Aura, you also get credit money monitoring, antivirus, VPN, password management, parental controls, identity theft monitoring, and insurance all in one single affordable app. That's easy. You might say, but AC, I've already got a VPN. Yeah, but do you have all of it? What's the point of locking the front door if your garage is wide open? Have all the tools. That way you can have your privacy and protect it like I value mine. Just check out Aura.com slash Angry Cops. Click the link below and get your free two-week trial. See the advantages for yourself. And we're back to the memes! Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. I've done it once and I'll do it again. Somebody made a Marty Robbins meme for me. Let's kick it off! Military ballads and army songs. The big sham. Canteen water. 0430 PT. Unsecured weapon. Private, where is your battle buddy? PT belts call. Little crack house. Basement Jesus. Stolen valor. In the army. Back pain, zero, 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 zero. Private potato, <laughs> games, and stolen valor. The full length version. I think Blue Falcon made this for me again, and that guy's Photoshop -like game, it is just, it is on another tier. When you're tired of MREs, if that's not the Appalachia National Guard, I don't know who is. They're just like, hey man, I just hit this deer, and uh, I figured why waste it? Saw it side of the road, picked it up, threw it in the back, figure we take it out on a four day weekend in the middle of the range and have ourselves a barbecue. Shoot. You ever have venison? It's delicious. I reckon I wouldn't mind having a little supper. Mm -hmm. uh, speaking of Photoshop, I love the Photoshop. My penis, when I'm about to beat it for the fourth time today in a hot latrine. You take one sweaty gym workout photo and you guys just Rick me through the coals. I wouldn't change it for the world. No one. Lieutenant Colonel Jacob Sweatland. Hello. Oh God, this one's dark. This one's dark. Get, oh, get ready for it. Screw the children. Uvalde police. Lieutenant Commander Martinez. Oh my word. Oh, for those of you that don't know, yeah, the Uvalde, everybody knows about that. But Lieutenant Commander Martinez in the Navy got caught paying a 15 year old to do some things. <whistles> Did a video on it like three weeks ago. Yeah, and I'll link the video up here. Are you ready to join Helldivers? For democracy! Fred managed democracy throughout the galaxy. Too much? I don't know if, if this is a meme or not. I don't know if this is real or a meme. I don't see why that wouldn't be real though. Just mobile air defense. I think it's brilliant. If we haven't made that, we should make that. And if we have made it, somebody show me it working. Uh, there's gotta be a video somewhere of it actually like operating. All the troops would be safe from any incoming rounds. Ow, 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 warning, warning. Good to go. My knees. What? 
What did you do to me? The army. I took away your bending. What's that? Why? That's my favorite meme of this angry meme review. Tell them what they want, AC. They bought a Voodoo Tactical Level 3 Assault Pack. That's right, with all these zippers and doodads and molly gear, you can hang anything that you want off of this backpack. A small child, an extra magazine, you can even put a bulletproof insert in this bad boy and make sure your kids stay alive during the next school shooting. That's right, Smitty 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 ass. You get a hold of me in the DMs on Instagrizzles or Reddits and I'll send you a care package. Is Rich the Quizzat's Hatterack? May thy knife chip and shatter. <laughs> That's my grandfather's World War II K-Bar. And I did a really good joke about it before, accidentally. Oh, NCO of the Swamp, what is your wisdom? We could have gone around this, sir. Got demoted for using my government travel card incorrectly, so my company decided to make my going away plaque a government travel card. Now that's army. I don't, if you've never been in the military, when you fuck up, that becomes your nickname. That becomes what you're known for. Camp Pendleton, the Marines can fix the barracks. The barracks. Just did a video on that one. Camp Pelton making Marines fix the barracks. Whatever. When you are the reason for sharp training. I want to go to Chow, but I can't find my reflective belt. If, oh my God, deployed overseas became insanity when all of a sudden it was like 2009. They were like, you got to wear your PT belt everywhere that you go when it's at nighttime because one person got hit by a truck. So now we're all just lit up in the middle of the night waiting for a sniper to hit us. The most fucking stupid bullshit ever. Every commander, look at me officers, this is your fault. You're all fucking stupid for making us do that. Dumbest shit ever. World War II, our grandfathers were running around at night totally wearing fucking reflective belts because safety, because one person got ran over by a truck. You're fucking embarrassing. That one Joe purposely chugging caffeine and overpacking his chew so he can get that no lube medic handshake. Funny that Diddy is in that. Very funny. Diddy will definitely probe you. Allegedly, when you and your E4 buddy acquire some danger putty to relocate the pedo lieutenant colonel and his car to the next county. Lisan al Gaib! Lisan al Gaib! Oh, that, somebody made a couple good memes about the $18,000 man camps. And uh, you know what? I'm just gonna let this video speak for itself. And we can charge anything we want, 2000 a day, 10000 a day, and people will pay it. And then there's the merchandise, and I can personally... Donald, agree. Donald, this park was not built to cater only for the super rich. Everyone in the world has the right to enjoy these animals. Now that's all she wrote for the randomness, but now it's time for your homework class. That's right. We now get to see what you delightfully delectable deviants have used this fantastic meme template for in... Tortured by demons, getting poked with the pitchety forks, and me standing there either being your savior or a part of the problem. Let's get into it. Photoshop. You guys are great at Photoshop, and I love the Photoshop. Case in point, Karate Kid. Wax on, wax off, Daniel San. That's right, I taught Daniel San and Mr. Miyagi. I was there, totally. Who's the master? Oh, what movie is this from? Oh, it's, it's, it's like, ah, oh, shit, come on. The Last Dragon? Is it, is it The Last Dragon? Oh, I've seen it. Put a clip in there, Pat. Who's the one and only master? I am. Ah! Oh. I am. The parents, Epstein probably, Harvey Weinstein, your mom, Hollywood, Dan Schneider, Nickelodeon kids, oof. They can't get away. You're not the same since you joined the military. Alcohol as a PTSD, ZRTC, 29 palms, Iraq deployment, nicotine addiction, Camaro at 28% APR. You, the president's laughing in the background, has me dying. His stare, just George Bush in the corner and Barack Obama and Biden, love it. When the strippers find out you have TRICARE, run. The E1 who left his rifle unattended. Now we're talking. This is what happens when your med pros is read. When the command sergeant major walks in on the E4 mafia gang banging the new butter bar. Drill instructor, this is what happens when you don't have your battle buddy. That face when someone asks you what it's like being a cop in 2024. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. pretty much. Everything's my fault? Oh, thanks. Don't blame the guy with the gun that shot at me and robbed a car. It was, okay, it's just, it's just not my fault then. 
whatever. When you're the only boot to notice the first sergeant silently standing there. Eddie, too late, too late, drop. Those few Marines who enlisted specifically to fight demons because of a game from 1993. Dude, if it was that easy, if it was Earth versus aliens, like Doom or Helldivers, we would all get along. We'd have a common enemy, we would just plow forward, killing bucks. When the US Coast Guard says they are the same. <laughs> There's nobody gets to pick on the Coast Guard, but we get to pick on the Coast Guard, all right? We get to, nobody else though. Some civilian picks on the Coast Guard, they can suck my fat Brandon Herrera's politician initiation. Don't fall for it, Brandon. Don't fall for it. Don't be a piece of shit like Tony Gonzalez. Tony Gonzalez actually uh, called Brandon a neo-Nazi. By the way, Tony Gonzalez is in the district that Brandon Herrera is running for. Brandon Herrera is running against Tony Gonzalez. And Tony Gonzalez, a lying piece of shit, called Brandon a neo-Nazi. And now I'm all about supporting Brandon Herrera and saying Tony Gonzalez, a lying piece of shit, who called my friend a neo-Nazi. He's a liar and uh, we don't need any more liars in office. So, vote for Brandon. Okay, carry on. The 11th time my battle saves me from another bad decision. Oh my gosh, that is true. Good friends just rescuing us from ourselves. Now that does it for this angry meme review, but just like every angry meme review, I give you a little bit of homework. Kapow! That's Eli. He's just so absolutely defeated and tired that he looks like an 80 year old crackhead. That's looking on the ground to find one cigarette butt for a final puff. And if you're having trouble trying to put this into a meme format, <laughs> allow me to help you. It's always, hell yeah, brother, and never, how are you, brother? So take this fantastic meme template and make your own memes with it. But don't forget to tag hashtag angry meme review so that I can look at it, view it, and then throw it up the next angry meme review. So the best way to support the channel is to get yourself a shirt. I've got a new shirt, it's offensive, and I think you'll enjoy it. Welcome to Palestine. That's right, I made a t-shirt about the airdrop that crushed a couple Palestinians that were too dumb to get out of the way. Dark humor, yes. Inappropriate, possibly. Rude, indefinitely. Who cares? Anyway, cheapest way to support the channel is leave a comment. Tell me what your favorite meme was. Tell me what your least favorite meme was. All right. See you next time, weirdos. Never too soon for a good boat one.